stand up and protect our children or stand back. Give me liberty and give them freedom. Parents and other concerned citizens plead with school officials to let their children go to school without wearing a mask. Good evening, everyone. School officials starting the new year by adopting a new statewide policy. They say essentially has their hands tied. The state says all children aged two and up must wear a mask inside a school building, whether they are vaccinated or not. Masks are optional outside. Students can also take them off when they're eating their lunch. The state getting some pushback. The Christian Central School in Williamsville is suing to try and get this mask mandate revoked. Tonight, Jeff Rusak brings us more on the response from some parents who say masks in schools put their children at greater risk. The Frontier Central School District starts classes on Wednesday. Like every other district in the state, nearly all students will have to wear masks for a majority of the school day. Tuesday night, at a school board meeting, most parents who stood front and center demanded masks be optional. The blood's going to be on your hands. The superintendent explaining that their hands are tied, saying the masks are to protect students and staff, and going against the mandate would put their state funding in jeopardy. He said he's already short-staffed. If our drivers fall or our staff gets quarantined and cannot come to school, I simply won't have anybody to put in front of your children to teach them. Parents calling for unmasking say the masks do more harm than good. It's also very clear that they're not in any danger. And to your point, Mr. Swiatek, I respect the fact that you're trying to protect your teachers and your staff, but they've had the opportunity to take the vaccine. All but one speaker called for unmasking. Mask them. People are dying in Florida in Texas. Kids are. We already have proof that masks work. Parents who are against the mandate want the Frontier School District to file a suit against the state allowing families to have the choice. In Hamburg, Jeffrey Sack, 7 Eyewitness News.